Welcome to prayer and coffee. Evening, morning, and at noon, I will pray and cry aloud, and he shall hear my voice. It shall come to pass that before they call, I will answer, and while they are still speaking, I will hear. God has already and is still in the process of answering our prayers for our families, for our children, for the lost, for those who are far from God, those who have grown cold and drifted away. But it's a continuing battle. Satan will never give up until he is chained and thrown into the bottomless pit. So our prayers and even our personal times of fasting must continue. And the goal of our warfare is to pull down the strongholds of Satan in our families, in our children, in the lost. To cast down arguments and lies he has caused people to believe. That they may come to their senses and escape the snare of the devil, having been taken captive by him to do his will. We battle in prayer from Jesus Christ triumph at the cross and the power of his resurrection for this purpose the son of god was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil keep praying keep fasting let's pray father how i look forward to an eternity without the devil and the darkness he brings an eternity where we are finally free from the curse of sin but we are here right now, still in a battle over the souls of those who have been snared by this spirit of this present darkness. Those who have drifted from your truth, Lord. Those who have laid aside their calling and their gifts to pursue other things. So we pray, Father, that you hear our pleading for their souls. Lord God, for our children, our grandchildren, for our families, for our nation, Holy Spirit, open their eyes to the truth of God, the Word of God. Break down the strongholds of deception and free them from the snare, the lies of the devil. Expose every argument and everything that exalts itself against the knowledge of you, Father. And by your Spirit, lead every thought and purpose back to Jesus Christ. Father, I confess through your Word, your favor over my life, over my family, over your church. Our eyes are on you, Jesus. Amen.